Hi, I'm Jessica with that hashtag show, and I'm here to talk to Mariana Trevino, who's in the new movie, A Man Called Otto. Now, this is uh, based on a book by Swedish author Frederick Bachman, who is one of my favorite authors personally. So I'm wondering, uh, did you know about the book beforehand? Did you see the Swedish movie, or were you new to this coming in? Hi, Jessica. Um, I'm glad you're a fan of Frederick. He is an extraordinary um, writer. Uh, I was not aware of the novel beforehand. I read it right before starting the the um, the movie, and of course, I loved it. He is great. He conveys, you know, everything um, with such detail and such emotion. And I'm so glad that that could be translated into the script by uh, David McGee and Mark, and the whole work done to it. Absolutely. And Marisol is one of those characters that I feel like you just instantly fall in love with. Like, it's mm -hmm. such a great time seeing you bring that character to life. So Thank what you. did you like the most about her? And what are some of your favorite Marisol moments? Um, well, I loved being able to portray um, a character that that is um, generous of heart and that doesn't give up on Otto. I love that energy. I love tapping into it. Um, I love doing a character that represents not only Mexicans, but the Latin American community and to put on the platform values of the, of our way of being that are, um, that are, you know, treasures of, of, you know, and, and that can be shared and that can be uh, celebrated as well. So that was an honor for me. So this is a really heartfelt and relatable movie. I love that the characters feel like people that we really know. I think we've all met an Otto or had uh, hopefully had a Marisol in our life. So what do you really want people to take away from this movie and these characters? Well, I really, I, I just really um, enjoy the fact that people take away whatever resounds in them. The movie and the themes are so varied. And so interconnected um, in this great story, you know, there, there are some, it starts from the novel, as you well pointed out, you know, and it just, the story contains this uh, myriad of themes and human truths and just very fundamental things uh, of our human condition. So uh, people go see it and they get very emotional. They get very connected to it in various ways. So I love the openness of it. And um Things can resound differently depending on our own experience. But definitely one great thing about this movie is how we have the ability to the very last days of our lives. It's never late to reconnect back to life, to reconnect back to, to our own hearts and to feel useful in this life. And useful in the sense not of uh, utilitarian, you know, it's just being able to put yourself to a to a to a good for your own soul, you know, to give what you have, to offer it, to put it out there into the world, and we're hoping that this movie does just that, puts out love out there because it's much needed. Definitely, and I love what you're saying about it never being too late to do that either, because I think yeah. that's a big lesson for all of us. Yes, <laughs> thank you. Yeah. All right. Last question: If you personally were trying to win over a grumpy neighbor, how mm -hmm. would you do it? I really like the wearing them down with delicious food approach myself. I think that's a good one. Yeah, they can't they can resist that. They start like <laughs> warming up. Well, yeah, the food is great because the food really um, brings you, it's like open, putting a piece of your home, an offering. It's, it's really an offer and uh, about uh, this little piece of home. And I think that's what is for Otto. It's like he's sitting down for a hot meal in a very long time. And 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 uh, it's this sense of home and of warmth. It's like the bonfire, you know, uh, is there that makes you start reconnecting to that. Yeah, and uh, I think that was a great technique. I would normally just kind of, I don't know, I just suppose that sometimes a smile is enough and a, a high. It can go a long way and we don't know it. <laughs> That's very true. Simple acts of kindness. Yes. Awesome. Well, thank you so much for sitting down to talk with me today. Everybody yes. go out and see a man called Otto. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.